Hello everyone and welcome back to my channel. I'm Christopher with Plan Your Truth and in today's video I'm going to be making a page for my classic happy planner all about setting my quarter two goals. So if you're unfamiliar with my channel, I created a bunch, I'm big on goals, so each month I do uh, a goal sheet for that month. But back at the beginning of the year, I set goals for the year, as well as this like 21 things to accomplish in 2021. I'll link all of my goals videos for you, um, but I wanted to take some time to just kind of reevaluate my goals for quarter two. I'm not really changing anything up, but I have a couple things that I want to focus on in quarter two. So that is what this page is for. I have this goals sticker book and also some flower power stickers that I want to add just to make it look super pretty. So I don't really know exactly what I'm going to do here, but um, let's just dive in and kind of figure it out together. I think that these florals work really well with this gold sticker book. So I know that I want to include these. So let me just pull some of these. Um, I'm thinking about doing, I don't know about a whole corner situation, but maybe some like a cluster right here and maybe at that in that top corner. Because I think all these colors will just work with what I'm working with. Yeah, maybe we could just do a whole corner. Let's try it. I'll put it down lightly. So if we have something like that, and then we just need something there, but let's see if I cut these scraps, if that will be enough. Okay, so let's see if these scraps would be enough. Um, I don't know, let's, let's try it. Maybe pull in one more thing here. I don't know if it's enough for like another floral, but I could at least bring in this like big leaf. Yeah, I think that's perfect. Okay, that looks really good. So now let's do not the same thing, but let's do another kind of cluster up in this corner. So let's try and start with this one. I think we really like that. And then I at least want to bring in one of these kind of pinky colors. Although maybe it's enough. Maybe just the floral is enough. Let's try just that. I think it looks okay. Let me try. I think what would help is I kind of need to cut it off here as if it, that were the corner. Because I don't want to continue the corner unless I do it. Let's see. Let's make... A straight cut right here. Okay, yeah, I think that that will really help because now we can continue the corner a little bit at least. And then I want to add some greenery. Maybe just a little bit would be enough. Yeah, I think that's a cute little start to our page. So let's just start there and then we can always add some more florals as needed. So let's now move into this gold sticker book because there's one thing I know for certain that I'm doing. I have three goals that I, I guess they're the three larger goals that I have three action steps that I want to break them down into. So I want to use these for that. So I have three of these and then I have three smaller goals. So I love this color and I think that it works really well. So I definitely want to use this one. I think I want to just do these right here. One, two, three. But let's see what other colors. I think we probably can use that pink and maybe this green. I'd love to use the purple, but I haven't brought any purple in. So I think blue, pink, and green would be best. So I want to do the pink in the middle. Let's, I guess, let's start with that one, the middle one. Just to get this as centered as we can. So I want to leave a little bit of room up at the top to make some kind of a header. I don't know how or what I'm doing there yet, but... Okay, and then let's do the blue one here. Oh, it's a little bit, it's not, I didn't line it up perfectly. So what we'll have to do because I don't want to risk ripping it up. That's a big sticker. So 
let's pull this one now and just kind of try and line this up with the blue one. So that was like a little bit below the pink. Okay, I like that. I think that that works well. I think that looks good. So up here we'll write Q2 goals somewhere. Then I have three smaller goals that I just need three like littler boxes to do down here. I think I want to use these big plans boxes. So pink, green, there's not a blue one of them though. That's a little bit annoying. Um, so maybe we'll do this one instead. Or I think maybe I'll do... Let's see, definitely doing the green and the pink. Let's see, will these all, will three fit? Hmm, it's gonna be tight, I think, actually, that three will fit. I may have to layer a little bit, let's see. Put this one as far over as it can go. Although I'd rather just kind of cover up some of the florals. Let's see if this will come up. I think it'll just look better. So if that was like that, just putting it down lightly, I think that I would like this best. So then we'll, we'll do the light purple, I said. Okay, yeah, I think that looks really cute. So that's enough boxes for all of the goals. So I'm looking at all my alphabet stickers and none of them really are calling to me and I could just use black, but there's not really any other black on the page. So, okay, so I'm gonna, let's, let's talk about what these goals are and do some writing and then I can figure out how I wanna do the title. The first big one here, and I'm gonna do this in the center, is to establish a morning routine. So I found in my in my overall yearly goals, a lot of my goals are very vague, like focus on my wellness, or, or actually I think that one I changed to losing weight. But that still is too vague. So I want to focus on my morning routine. And in that morning routine, well, you'll see in the action steps, we will work up to like adding a workout and different things in. So step one for that is to wake up a half hour earlier and then use that time to journal and plan. Okay, so then step number two, so once I'm doing that consistently, then I also want to add in eating breakfast and drinking water. Again, these are some goals of mine, smaller goals, but I'm stacking them together into like a morning routine. So we'll start with just journaling and planning. Then I want to make sure that I'm eating breakfast and drinking water each day. And then we will add in a morning workout. I need to build myself up to here. I'm not here yet and I've accepted that. So I need to just do some other things before I can get to that point. Okay, so then Let's make this blue one plan your truth. So the overall goal is to grow this channel, grow plan your truth. Okay, and these are not necessarily in any specific order, but these are just three things that, three habits that I want to solidify. Um, so first off, I wanna post two reels on Instagram weekly. If you don't follow me over on Instagram, I'm having a lot of fun with the reels. I just discovered them a couple weeks ago, but I'm having a lot of fun with them. So make sure to go follow me over there. Um, and then I want to get better about commenting on YouTube. And this is, I'm pretty good at replying to my comments. This is mainly other channels because that's a way to grow this channel is to comment on other planning channels so that people maybe can find me so um, I want to get better at that and then going along with that kind of like marketing a little bit um, I want to post in the Facebook groups that allow it I want to post my videos so that's for plan your truth and then this green one will make our financial goal because I have another smaller one but this goal is to begin 
to plan for retirement. So I, I contribute to my 401k and everything already, but I don't really know much about where that money is, how much money I have in that account. So my first step for that is to look into my 401k. And that is like, where's my money going and how much money? Those are like my main questions that I don't really know. So I need to figure that out. And then I want to, step two is to research other options. And one of those I think is like a Roth IRA. I really don't know anything people. So I want to research what my options are. And then step three in quarter, all of this in quarter two, hopefully is to pick. Okay. So then in these boxes, I'll write when I started, when I ended and any other notes there. Okay. So then my three smaller goals, uh, the green one's finance. So that is to do extra payments money, uh, monthly to my student loans. I've been doing a really great job at this, but I want to continue doing that. And then let's do this purple one, clean weekly. I tried really hard to do like a cleaning schedule and a cleaning routine. And I don't have that big of an apartment. There's like four rooms total. So I think that one day a week I can just clean my whole apartment. So I want to try that. And then this one is to... I think I'm just going to write, oh, I don't know what to write here. I want to get better at my healthy cooking. Maybe in this quarter, I can just find some healthy meals that, that I'm good at cooking. Let's, let's do that because I really hate cooking. So if it's like a lot of work, it's not really going to work for me. Okay. Um, let's see. I really, guys... Like, it's such a pretty page. I really love it. And I really just want to write up here. And I think I'm going to do it. It's my page. I can do what I want, right? I hope I'm not ruining this page. <laughs> Quarter two goals. I hate writing big. I don't even think it looks that good. And it's not centered, so I'm going to add a heart there. Listen, it's fine. <laughs> it is what it is. Um, but this came out really pretty. I love how this works. Um, and I can't wait. I just want to put this at the front of my planner in a spot where I'm always going to look at it and really focus on all of these things in quarter two. So I still will be coming out with my April monthly goals and you'll probably see some of these things on there. So a little sneak peek, but I love doing this and I love making it look kind of pretty, but, uh, thank you so, so much for watching. If you like this video, hit that thumbs up button. If you want to see more of my videos, hit that subscribe button. And remember to plan your truth so that you can live your truth. Thanks so much.